What do you think of Dan? Oh, Dan is a shit. Do you want to expand on that? Sure. He's a uh, massive and total shit. Okay, well, do you see this? Do you see this right here? You know what this is? This is me playing fuck you on the world's biggest cello. God, you know, if I had a dollar for every time you mentioned that goddamn war, I would buy a tank and I would blow your fat fucking head off. Jesus, what the fuck? Stop acting fucking nuts. You know, if Mike were here, we would have spent the entire flight watching him do scratch or lotto tickets going, oh. So close. Every time he lost. The whole oh, fuck, I Mike. Shut up, Mike. How the fuck do you screw up a handshake, Mike? It's four figures and a thumb. Because all ambition you had left your body a long time ago, and now all you've got left in the last ten remaining years of your working life is a damp apartment, cold crab cakes, and an invisible fucking dog. Like, why would you send me this shit? I mean, you might as well have just sat on the fucking keyboard and sent me that. Mentally, you're in a fucking hammock on a back porch. Don't fuck up that suit, Mike. Like, you're right through a bendy straw, too, right, Mike? Shit stack. Time to turn that noose back into a necktie, buddy. You have to no. forge the president's signature on the new one. Well, that's a capital offense if you... What? Yeah, you could be I, illegally electrocuted for doing no. that, just so you know. The key is you do it upside down. That is extraordinary. Yeah. Is there anything you can't do? Or play direct sunlight? Actually, she's not my girlfriend anymore. I just broke up with her about 15 minutes ago via text. You would have her start her campaign with no strategy, no money, no staff, except for Superman and Wonder Woman over there. Just, you know, I want to be president. Or anything Jesus like Fucking country. Christ. All right, look, watch me, Otis. All right, you take the little pod, put the little pod in the fucking hole, shut the fucking lid, hit the fucking button for two fucking seconds. Oh, it's so easy. Too quick, I didn't see it. Yeah, well, next time, pack an espresso machine in your big fucking bitch bag. Oh, my God. Daddy. Shut the fuck up, Gary. Why the fuck are we here? Okay. We're gonna be right in the line of fire. There. Relax, cow eyes. All right. You look leukemic. Gary. Gary Walsh. He's the bag man. Yeah, but he's also, uh, the bad man. Sorry I ever said foot in that fucking fish eating any film fucking hellhole. Like a noisy fucking ghost, really. <laughs> Jesus, more apologizing, really? I apologize less after I banged my brother's fiance. You need three versions of your statement. Uh-huh, like what I say happened, what they say happened, and the truth, right? You're backing up? Just fucking go straight! I none of these people genuinely like you. So fucking what? Dan Egan. That's Dan with a capital D and Egan with an open your fucking ears. I swear to God, I felt better on the fucking boat. You shouldn't tweet your location to someone who wants to kill you, Jonah. <laughs> oh, you see this, Jonah? Yeah. This is what happens when you fuck with my office. You fucking ape. Did your abuser touch both of your testicles? How about your side dick here? You shut the fuck up. You shut the fuck up. That's what I'm doing. Go fuck yourself, Jack and the Giant Freak Stock. You are a useless waste of fucking carbon. Joker and Penguin beat us to it. I can't have a terrorist chicken fucker next to the president. You colossal fucking fanny pack. Look, zip it, Jeeves. I'm in the middle of firing your boss. That shit shoveled face fucking Jonas. Like an old VCR but with a bigger mouth. What's Google's number? I don't know. Ask Jeeves. It's not even the way it works, you fucking idiot. You're so stupid, you don't even know that you're being used for your stupidity. He you should really be on suicide watch. Yeah. Make sure he goes through with it. You know what? You are you I'm helping you out. Let's go. Come on. No, let's go. Come on. Nothing says regular American like standing on a street corner shouting at strangers. You're talking to a guy who once broke off an engagement at an Applebee's and then ordered dessert. Password mother underscore fucker. Here's four verbal cues for you. Tell me now, asshole. I have no soul. <laughs> Thank you. I owe you one. Of course you do. Why else would I have done it? I'm genuinely sorry that my arrival here has caused you to become so self-conscious and gain a little weight. But you need to calm down. Go to a spa, take a Pilates class, go to a fucking church, find someone there that has some Valium, and take four of them. How low can you go? Well, however low it is, Amy, I'm still higher than you. That's bullshit. I love abortion, oh. okay? Oh. I am an abortionado, but I would go pro-life in a fetal fucking heartbeat if it meant winning. I need you to get Selena a meeting with Prince Charles. That 65-year-old fucking intern. Well, she's gonna drink it and she's gonna smile. Is that why you look like you want to drink a bottle of Drano? So if she doesn't turn this fucking shit show around, guess what? I don't know which way I'm gonna bounce. And chop this thing into like a disputed kitten. Oh, hey, you hey, you hey, get hey. your hands off me, all right? I don't want to catch your fucking idiots. Okay. What are, you, what, are you, what are you, molesting coma patients? Okay, Yogi and Boo Boo, you say nothing to anyone, you understand me? Yes. Well, obviously you don't because you just fucking spoke. Oh, my first thought was there goes your figure, but I didn't say that because I thought it would be upsetting. Stop screaming. <laughs> Thanks for sending me the speech, Mike. It's perfect. Great. Holy shit. You know what? Your first drafts are always terrible. Wake up, smell the fucking burrito juice. No, I didn't send her a get well card because you don't get a get well card when you have plastic surgery. Yeah. Call them the expendables. Um, you're a sex trafficker now. Can you take on clients who are best served by you shitting on the Meyer agenda? Oh, uh, well, let me think about that. 
Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was clear. We just need to pick a fucking number, any fucking number. Give that fucking number to the fucking press and go to fucking bed. I mean, how much more clarity do you need? You want to put it on a fucking T-shirt? Come on. Do you realize what you've done? You just picked a fight with the jumpiest hundred million people I can possibly think of. Soon, there will be no more Selenas. You are looking at the last Selena. There are no more Adolfs. You guys are the chosen ones, all right? Not in a Jewish way, either. On air, I'm gonna keep in with her. Off air, I'm telling the Nazis that she's hiding in the attic. My brain feels like it's being fucking circumcised. I diagnosed myself with an acute case of everything's fine. This is what happens when you tell the truth. Nothing good comes of it. I do like to lick the rim. He's a less talented, ugly version of me. He's basically a human comfort blanket. Quite the will for yourself. We can do anything we want if we really want to. The best way to get revenge on these people is to use them to make a shitload of money. <laughs> money. I love money. We should form a suicide pact. Jesus, you know, I always thought the old Amy was kind of an uptight bitch, but now I sort of miss her. So let's cut out the whole keep her away from scissors thing. Okay. Yeah. Just like an English. Is that a racist joke? Yeah. No, I, I don't like to toot my own horn, but... Uh, <laughs> Food nominal. You know, at least three of these kids are probably mine. Okay. Can you move in with her once? For like a month. <laughs> she didn't like my untidiness or my other girlfriends. What would you like? To eat at a different fucking restaurant. Why have you blinded the president, Gary? Back on, now, idiot. We cannot let Mr. Zucchini, the human vegetable, find out about this. Those fuckers probably think the Middle East means Kansas. Jesus, I can feel my virginity growing back in here. It's bullshit. You had no fucking idea. Your fucking head's gonna spin around. I am surprised the two of you even found your way out of your own mother's vaginas. Yeah, you heard me. I'm gonna call those fucking nerds right now. When I was a kid... Yeah? A bunch of older kids... dared me oh. to <laughs> kill this stray dog, and I did. Really?